Hi, I'm Mary Blackman, founder of Farm Star Living, and people know me as Farm Star Mary. I'm here to take you behind the scenes of the organic produce world. And it is a hot potato topic, no pun intended. But whether or not you're an organic food advocate or more of a traditional shopper, there is no denying that organics are on the rise. So let's go talk to the produce companies that are bringing the organic food to market. Let's go. Many people think that if a fruit or vegetable has a thick skin, that it really doesn't matter if it's organic or conventional. But apparently, it does. It's all from the ground up. So if the soil isn't organic, then many people here think the food is not as good. So I'm learning that many of these companies weren't necessarily into organics until they learned that their customers wanted it. So they started building more and more organics into their growing patterns, and now some of them are up to 50%. At least this company is up to 50% in organics. So they're listening to you. One other trend I'm seeing is in salads. You used to see just maybe the one lettuce in a bag. Well, I'm seeing actually a lot of combined vegetables, organic beets, kale, all put in one bag to make things very easy and simple for families. You know, another great trend I'm seeing is in packaging. As a matter of fact, something like this, which is really unique, uses 90% less plastic, so much better for the environment. And it's compostable. See this? This is wood fiber. So you can put it right back in your backyard garden. One more package I saw that was really cool was this. It has light blocking technology so that their potatoes won't turn green, won't turn bitter, and will last longer, still without the pesticides. Well, I'm also meeting amazing innovators like this guy, who's been making some incredible products so that you too can grow mushrooms at home, have an hydroponic system, grow wheatgrass, all by just simply buying it from your grocery store. You know, some companies are bringing things you'd never even think about to market, like the broccoli leaf. Broccoli. So here's an interesting trend. They're actually taking blueberries, and these are, of course, organic, and they're freeze drying them like this. So now you can have healthy organic blueberries basically all year long. And they tell me that it still keeps all the nutritional value. Pretty cool. Do you look at these gorgeous mushrooms? And they're organic. However, they are a bit more expensive. And when I was asking about that, I learned that perhaps it's justified. They actually have to farm 20% less to grow organic. So the cost has to come from somewhere. Unfortunately, sometimes that's passed along to you. But maybe it's worth it. Well, we sure have met a lot of amazing organic produce companies who are certainly passionate about bringing their quality produce to you. I so appreciate you joining me for Farm Star Mary's Minutes, and hopefully I'll see you on a farm.